Hey guys, it's Cauliflower. Welcome back to my channel. How are you guys doing? I hope you're doing well. Yes, I have crawled out from underneath my rock and decided to film today. Well, why? Today is an Ipsy subscription unbagging, unboxing, however you want to call it. I have um, the Ipsy Glam Plus and I have the regular base bag. Um, Ipsy's been around for a very, very long time now, ever since I've been here, which is quite a long time. So I kind of held on and, you know, still get the subscription every now and again. And unfortunately, sometimes I get more than I remember I purchased or what have you. So that's what's happening today. We have a couple of Ipsy Glam Pluses and we have a couple of the bases. And I hope my camera is not screwing up because the lighting has been kind of off. So if it is, I apologize. I know that this is like, you know, the Michael Hutchins of um, In Excess Fame hair. If you guys don't know who he is, Google him. That band is awesome. But yeah, today is all about like looking like the 80s uh, Brit rock people. <laughs> anyway, let's get started. So we will be starting with the Ipsy Glam Plus bag, which is inside of this pouch here. And I don't know what it is, but I guess Ipsy doesn't believe in putting everything into the bag itself. I don't know why my camera is being extremely weird. So we're going to tone this down a little bit. But anyway, um, Ipsy keeps putting like loose things into the pouches instead of putting them in the bag. I don't know what that's about. Anyway, so loosely, first off, we have this product from GoTo. And I don't know if you can see that. There it is. It is called the Removalist with kaolin clay and zinc oxide it is a detoxifying clay mask for a complete clean out i don't even want to respond to complete clean out okay uh ipsy's got a thing with masks i don't know it's like i i could get down with a mask but it's like they they oversaturate you with masks and sometimes it's not necessary sometimes that extra step is just not necessary but We'll, we'll check it out. We'll see what's going on with that. I don't know what is happening with this camera. It's like acting very, very strange today. So if it keeps going orange, that's just for some reason the lighting is just, I don't know what it is. And I'm trying to tone it down a little bit, but in any events, let's go on to the next thing that's in here, which is falling apart. Oh, look at that. It's falling into the bag because it's this little pouch of refreshments. Refreshments is something that Ipsy added on a few years ago. I think it's for, you know, the younger crowd. Um, these are razors. They're razor blades. I'm hoping that if that's the case, here's what they look like. If that's the case that they're going to also include, there's quite a few in here. They're also going to include a razor because without the razor, these would be kind of useless unless they're like universal. And they fit with everything else. I'm just taking everything out of here because it's annoying the crap out of me. All right. So this is what they look like as if I didn't show it to you before. They look like, um, you know, those, all of those subscription service female um, razors. They kind of look like those. And I do have one. And it kind of does need blades. But I don't think that this is for every blade. I think it's for just the ones that they send. So I'm just going to put that off to the side. And move on to the next thing that almost fell off my lap. This is from Butter. Mm -hmm. We're using the New York accent. Butter. Tea tree and aloe mask. Oh, it's a scrub. This time it's a scrub. It's not a mask. Okay, that's fine. I can get down with this. This I can get down with. So it says triple action clay mask. Here we go again with the mask. Foam cleanser and deep exfoliator, but it has like more than one purpose. You can use it as a mask, but I would rather kind of use it for the other two because that's more intriguing to me. And I like the fact that it has tea tree and aloe, which is calming and also disinfecting. And also if you have like acne or anything of that nature, like, you know, like pull a heart hard. No. Mm -hmm. Can you tell it's been a while? Large pores. <laughs> Anyway, that was in the, the bag. All right. Speaking of the bag, this is what it looks like. Isn't that cute? That's daisies. It's daisies for spring and April. And I can't believe that it's Easter weekend already. If you're watching this, who knows when this will go up, but it's, it's Easter weekend. It's just so weird that everything is going so fast. Oh, look, the cards in here. So it is keep growing 
this month. That's what the uh, theme of the bag is. Spring is here. And just like you, the earth has come alive. I don't know about that yet, Ipsy. I don't know if I've come alive, although I'm doing this video, so probably I have. All right, let's move on to the next thing. Ooh, now this is exciting to me. This is from Kimchi Chic, and it's Puff Puff Pass Set and Bake Powder. Ooh, get a load of the packaging on this. I only heard of Kimchi through, um, gosh, Kimberly Clark. Kimberly Clark, who is an OG um, on YouTube, I love her, um, and I don't know what if she's still doing the uh, YouTube thing, but Kimchi, I heard through her, and also through Luscious Massacre. Um, oh, look at the packaging on this, you guys. That is adorable. That is very cute. I almost don't want to unravel it, but I'm going to. Okay, so this is what it looks like. This is the packaging, and it is just... Oh, how cute. Look at that. This is really, really cute. It has a little puff. Oh, it's really nice. Oh my goodness. This is, this reminds me of like um, bunny tails. Don't ask me why. It just does. The feeling of it is very, very like smushy and, and velvety. That's what I was trying to get at. But anyway, that's kimchi. That's cool. I'm pretty excited about that. Again, there it goes. There it goes. Stop doing that camera. All right. Next thing in here is from Sandbar. This is Mirage. Mirage. Can you see that? It's a Mirage. And um, I'm assuming you are some kind of palette. Let's see. Are you a palette? Oh, yes, you are a palette. Oh, it looks like this. That's kind of cute. It's kind of like a beehive type of a thing, but those are very neutral colors. Very, very pretty. I kind of like, I kind of like that. I don't know. Let's see. I'm kind of intrigued. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, wait a minute. Back up. Back up. Let's see. Look at that. That's pretty swanky and shiny right there. If you can see it. There we go. All right. What do you think? That's pretty. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yes, I am. I'm just going to put a little bit. Just kind of dot it on. I know. I'm so random, but just want to see what it looks like. Ooh, that's pretty. Okay. I can get down with you, Sam Bar. That's really cool. All right. And that is one down. One down. So let's move on. We have the base bag as well. So let's do the base bag before anything else. And hopefully we have a card in here. Oh, we do. And I've got hair on me. That's great. <laughs> Keep growing. Keep growing. I'm just going to straighten this camera out once and for all. Keep growing again. Um, and... Still not listing the prices on anything. Big shocker. Here is what the bag looks like. It's really cute. Very, very cute. I like this little uh, pink aesthetic they've got, or peach aesthetic, actually. That's really cute. All right, let's see what's inside the base bag this month. So first thing I am pulling out is from Philosophy. Philosophy. I know, it's like so annoying that I can't get this to... Ugh. There you go. Philosophy. This is their Purity cleanser one step facial cleanser i think i've tried this before and i actually do enjoy that so very cool on that i am telling you this is going to annoy me that it keeps doing this i'm sorry guys i'm sorry i'm sorry is that better i don't know i think my camera is like not used to the ring light anymore i don't know all right moving on we have something from lovecraft and beauty another very popular um product from ipsy what is this? A long-lasting, non-sticky lip gloss that delivers a high shine and dazzling sheen. All right. So let's see what this looks like. Packaging is giving me, you know, the same. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, I like that. I like that, like, ombre kind of a thing. Kind of pretty. All right. Let's see. Oh, uh, okay. It looks like a peach. Let's see. All right. It's clear. I, if I keep saying all right. All right, huh? You knew it. You know, I was going to have it on. Oh, it's nice. It feels nice. It feels very, very, um, mm-hmm. Very, I don't want to use that word. It's going to pop up, that one. Um, it feels very nice. Hydrated. <laughs> I'm going to move on now. Okay, next thing in here is from Symbiosis. This is a collagen and I can't pronounce that word. I can't pronounce that word if you can read it. Okay, so it's collagen and something. Uh, instant perfecting primer. Okay, cool, a primer. <laughs> I 
I don't know because these things are so just tiny or the wording is so fancy schmancy that I'm like, okay, really? Do we have to go there? All right. Here's the primer and it feels like water. No smell to it, but it feels like water. Like it's not even like a, like a, an emollient. It's okay. Now I feel it getting kind of a little bit more moisturizing, but my goodness, it's very, very loosey goosey. Okay. So moving on. <laughs> and the last thing in the bag is from Harry. Wait, no, I'm lying. Honey Jarrett. This is rose clay. What did I say? It's another mask. It's another mask, guys. It's another mask. I don't understand what the masks are about, which is cool. I mean, again, but it's just, all right. This one is a rose one. A lot of people don't like rose scented things. I'm not one of those people. I happen to love it. Oh, it smells really nice. Okay, let's see what it looks like. Are you like one of those? Oh yeah, you're gonna be one of those thick ones too. I can see it now. All right, here we go. Can you see that? Yeah, there it is. Oh, it has a little bit of an exfoliant too. Okay. Oh, but it disappears. That's cool. So if you don't want your face to have like that caked on clay stuff, <laughs> that's not bad. But it smells really, really good. If you like roses, this is one This is one for you. A lot of people don't. I have to enjoy rose, so I'm glad about that. All right, there's one last thing in here that's in the um, pop poppy paper, I like to call it. And, uh, oh, how cute. This is from Farah or Farah. I never know how to pronounce that, but I like the packaging on that. What are you? Oh, it looks like you are a duo of duochrome eyeshadow. Let's see. Is that what you are? Yeah, that's what you are. And okay, it's decent. All right. So we get a little bit more interesting in this one with the cleanser and everything in the lip gloss that's pretty cool all right i know i know i know i have another one <laughs> have another one this is also oh no not this one this one this one this one right here which is again the ipsy glam plus and i have not i know open these things before you shoot your videos okay Again, they're all out of the bag. They're all in the Doshkan pouch. So we're going to start with Koa Life. Koa Life. And this is a vitamin C ooh, brightening oil. Okay, I can get down with the brightening oils. I can get down with the serums any day. That's awesome. Okay, let's see what you look like. Ooh, this is the bottle. This is the bottle and it's dark. So I am assuming that this is one of more the bougie vitamin C serums. Normally, vitamin C serums are supposed to be in darker bottles. A lot of the companies don't do that. Um, so it, it, it kind of says to me that some of their oils are not strictly vitamin C oils, that they're mixed with other oils. I don't know. But when I see them in a darker bottle, I'm kind of thinking this is a little bit more bougie. But I don't know because guess what? I'm going to assume the card's not in the bag. Let's see. And if it is, the prices aren't there. I guess Ipsy is starting to say that they don't want us to know what these are valued at. All right. Next thing, another very popular product with Ipsy is Ahava Levon Dead Sea Mud Derma Intensive Foot Cream. Okay. Coming in clutch with the Ahava. All right. That's cool. That's awesome for now because it's starting to be spring and soon will be summer. I cannot wait for that. So we know that our feet need to have a get, little bit of self-care as well. All right. I can get down with that. I can get down with that. That will work. Let's see what else is in this bag. All right. We got something else in the poppy paper <laughs> from Chiate. Chate, I know they're I know they're packaging by now. Chate, and this is a bamboo bronzer. I think this might be a repeat one for me. I think somewhere in my gala of Ipsy products, I might have a Chate bronzer. Oh, this is pretty. I might not. I don't know. I really do not know. Oh, that feels good. And I like the color. This will definitely work for me when my skin gets a little bit darker. I do like that. I do like Chiate, Chiate, London. It's very awesome. Um, so yeah, all right, let's move on. Let's see what else Ipsy's got in store for us. Okay, what do we have here? Ooh, this looks interesting. I hope this is an eyebrow pencil. It's a liquid and coal liner, okay, from a company called KP. Is that KP? 
I can't tell. Or HP. <laughs> she still can't read after all this time. Hip dot. You know, if I just looked at the side, I would have figured that out already, but no. <laughs> Hip dot. Okay, cool. This is a liquid and coal liner, so it can be used two way. We've got the liquid at the bottom, the coal at the top, and that's a nice dual thing. I actually love when I get new liquid eyeliners because I use them so often and they're starting to like, you know, I'm, I'm phasing them out of my, um, my makeup collection because some of them I've been ignoring. So I'm kind of glad that we're getting new ones so I can just shift out the old ones and put in the new ones. So what was that? Is what I was trying to say. It's going to be okay. All right. Look, oh, look, look, look now. Look at the bag. The bag is back. And it's got like one or two items left in it. It's really upset. Here's the card. Watch this. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why? All right. Let's see what else is left in the bag. Okay. We've got a Dr. Brandt product. This is Clean Biotic. Now watch how many things this has in it. pH Balance Yogurt Cleanser with Chlorophyll. Uh-oh. Okay. Um, dissolves stubborn impurities, helps replenish skin, moisture, maintain skin, pH balance. Okay, again, I can get down with the cleansers and the scrubs and the serums and things of that nature. That's awesome. All right, so that's it for Ipsy Glam Plus, I think. I think that's it for Ipsy Glam Plus. Um, I do have another base bag, and we can check that out and see what's in here. I'm assuming it's going to be probably similar stuff but I don't know. Oh, wait a minute. We got different bags this month too for keep growing. Oh, look, this one has the prices. <laughs> All right, we'll go through it only because this one has the prices. Okay, so first thing in here is a master patch from CosRx. CosRx, CosRx, what have you, whatever you want to say. So the master patch intensive, these are larger of those colloidal patches that you use for acne and blackheads and things of that nature. You just kind of just put it on. Um, if you have a, a incoming blemish or one that's been there and it's been really annoying and you put one of these lovely patches on and by morning, all that yuck that usually comes out of those things is on the little patch and you can just throw it away. And the, this uh, little bump that you have is now flattened out. Did I explain that good enough? Cause that's what this is for. And I give these to my daughter. So that's awesome. All right, what is the price on that? Now I can actually tell you. The price on the Cozarex is $12. Okay, well, that's good. All right, next, can I just say, I like this bag. I like this bag better than the other one. It's so cute. I love daisies. I love sunflowers. Sunflowers are my favorite. Daisies come in at a cute little second. All right, we got another one of the little bubble wrap packages, and this time it's I want to love you, PYT. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to bother because I have several of these already. Um, it's just a uh, upcycle, is that called? Upcycle eyeshadow and warm. I have so many of these that I'm not even going to bother. So it's probably going to go into either the donation pile or the giveaway pile. I know I have so many of these piles that oh, at some point I'll get to the giveaway pile. All right. Next thing in here is from Wander Beauty. Um, this is their mascara, their Unlashed Mascara Volume and Curl Mascara, yes. And this is a small sample size, so cool for travel and all of that. And I have had that full size before, um, and I think it's 26 bucks for the full size. Yes, it's 26 for the full size. So this is about, what are you? You are about 2.5 ounce, what have you, so... You can figure that out. All right. And the last thing in here is from Dear Beach. Okay. Can you even see that? Dear Beach. Dear Beach, what are you? Dear Beach Glossy Lip Oil. Cool. And a full size of this is normally about, oh, 25 bucks. Okay. Hmm. Dear Beach. Okay. Why do we call them that? Oh, this is what the oil looks like. And it doesn't have a smell. Okay. Oh, yes, it does. Yes, it does. It smells of candy. I was thinking it was going to be like some sort of like coconut smell or pineapple smell or mango, but no, it smells just like a fruity candy, just like one of those, you know, old time Jolly Ranchers or one of those pops, what have you. That's it for the, the, the both of these little base things and the oil 
lip gloss I did say was $25. Okay, so that is that is it. We have covered quite a bit of the Ipsy products. I have a lot um, of stuff to go through and um, try or move on or what have you. But in any case, thank you guys for being here and watching, and I will see you soon in my next video. Bye. Bye.